Oh, so we are now live. Hello, oh. everybody. Welcome on back to DCRL. Trey's actually allowed to stream this time. What, who would have thunk? Who? I'm here. Urban's here. We aren't going to have face cams tonight because Trey, Trey's PC still is having issues. But at least we can stream. We're vibing to that extent. At least. But Urban, K2 Living Energy, how you doing tonight, brother? Urban, K2 Living Energy is here today, guys. Wired off caffeine, I gotta study, but who studies when there's Rocket League? We never need to. That's what this I'm saying. This game is more important than school, and what I'm excited about is more live Div C action trade. Div so C, you said? Oh, hoo -hoo. I am pumped today. The only the right. best division for our best caster Urban Living, of course. But when we look at these MF and teams out here, we know you got Watermelon, and we got all these other goobers. <laughs> but it looks like we do got the good old Wada Esports making another debut on stream. Yeah. Alrighty. You want Simi me to talk about okay. first? Yeah. Simi's making fun of me. Who's making fun of you? Simi. Simi, don't make fun of Trace. Simi, you're supposed to make fun of your arch enemy, Urban. But besides that, so. Talking about Wada Esports, dude. I usually called them Watermelon. They were the old other team. They were playing the last time I cast. They were the team I casted. And I love them for their car designs, their team chemistry. It's just overall class. However, they are struggling at 0 and 2 right now during the season. But games, it's only it's only just a vision. It doesn't matter because when playoffs come, that's when you can really show off. But watermelons, East Watermelon. See, yeah, I'm gonna call him watermelon just because it's <laughs> hey. But Wada Esports, we got Chief Nick, who I say, say it now, I'll say it again. Seems to be a fan of mine. Um, always in whenever I'm playing in, Twi in the Twitch chat, so I respect that and I appreciate that, Chief Nick. And watermelon, I don't know much about him other than when I watched him play last time. Uh, I thought he did pretty good. And same with Maester. Um, I think they have what it takes. They have the team chemistry. Um, they struggled to score when I last watched them last time, and I did not see their second game, but hopefully I think for them, if they just can come out and get some early goals against uh, their opponents here tonight, then I think they'll have better success um, going into their games. If they can score early, I think that'll be their key to victory. But yeah, that's right. what I got to say for, uh, for a good old Wada East Bowl. Well, I mean, I want to talk about them a little bit more. Now we actually got a little bit more individual stats for them. Oh, Watermelon yeah, yeah. actually leading the league two saves a game. That is impressive. Getting the savior medal for them almost every single time. So uh, definitely looking for him to step up on defense. Ketel gifting his subs as he promised. Oh, I love to see, I love to see that. Thank you, Mr. Ketel. Shout out for losing to the monkeys. Go monkeys. <laughs> and... Uh, Thank you, Mr. Tool. I know you're not feeling the best and a little bit under the weather. And I hope you recover quickly. And that's the nicest I'll ever be to you. But Wada Esports, Chief Nick, Wada Millen, and Maester. Wow, what a team. I am. I really like their team logo. I really like their team dynamic. And I would really like to see them take a dub tonight. Even though only Sheezen is a very good counter pick. With two doodles, Aquamaniac, and Mushroom Man going one and one this season so far. What do you got to say about that, Urban? Um, yeah, since I forgot I can look at the statistics now since it is week two, um, I can give more information on these fellers. So only cheesing, as Trey said, Doodles, Maniac, and Mushroom Man. Mushroom? Um, well, they won a game, so therefore, having a better start than Wada technically. Um, and looks like they scored a little bit more. As people say, goals win games. Just makes sense. I've so said that before, good. yeah. <laughs> but yeah, what's this? Uh, this the stat here. Let's see. I'm gonna look in this column. Oh, the shots per game. That one seemed higher than a lot of other people. It seems like they're two duels and maniac are both shooting two and a half shots a game. Plus, with mushroom shooting at uh, three quarters of a shot per game, you know that kind of adds up to about six to seven. So they're putting a lot of shots on net. And you know, if they're able to just give this Wada Esports team a lot of pressure, then it'd be good. But Wada Esports also has insane saves, save stats. So it'll be interesting to see a high offense team versus so far uh, in my uh, high defense team kind of when it comes to the stats. And we'll have to see which the sword with the sword wins or the shield or like whatever that saying is. 
the you know what I'm talking about the impenetrable shield or the fully penetrating spear. I don't know. You guys get the point. You get the point. We'll say who wins. But yeah, um, I don't know who's gonna win. It should be good, but I'm excited to watch here. Okay. <laughs> uh, I guess they they just want to stall for a little bit longer, but I mean that gives us a little bit of time to actually say predictions. Urban Living. Okay, Who I was gonna say. Who do you want oh. to win? Game five, game four, game three. How are they doing it? Who's winning? First off, do we have predictions in the in the? Oh, we, we do, do actually. Let me look let me throw at some the, bucks. Let me look at. Uh, well, no one's predicting, so I don't want to predict just yet. But according to the ratio here, I'm gonna bet on. Ch not <laughs> Okay. Oh shoot! Uh, yes, I'm betting on Wada Esports now, which you know I wanted to bet on them anyways. And since, well, actually, no, 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 I can't do that. I can't do that. Here's the reason I'm not betting on you, Wada Esports. Every time I bet on that team, they freaking lose. Okay? They freaking lose. So I'm betting on Cheese for 500, trying to reverse the curse. So Wada Esports is the up tonight. <laughs> no, I'll try not to be biased towards each team. I'm just saying, if I bet on a team, they usually lose. Whoever put a ton of money on Wada, bless up, because if Cheese and does win tonight, I will win big. Thank you very <laughs> much. The K tool himself. I appreciate it. But yeah, um, but for seriousness, other than Bison Bucks, um, I'm, I'm gonna hope Wada gets their first dub tonight. I'm gonna say Wada. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. Two going to be a close one it depends if water can score get some goals early they will but if they struggle to score then i think uh, cheese will will take it absolutely i believe you are correct with that one so but ah uh, urban i think we're finally ready to get into this one what do you say we play some mfn rocket league here in dfh stadium oh my gosh i am so <laughs> party only there we go Everything's in order. I'm ready to play Rock League. I'm ready to watch Rock League. And I'm ready to cast with my good old boy, Urban MFN Living. How about we get into this game, Urban Living? Because I would love to. Would you love to? I am currently spectating. So we don't have to worry about me joining a team on accident, as that has happened before. <laughs> but here we go. Starting game one between Water Esports and I think it's Cheezin. Cheez it. Cheese it? Only cheese it. Sorry. Sorry to butcher the name. But see, as you can see already, Wada Esports putting on some pressure, actually. I already like it. And they're rocking their watermelon colored cars. I mean, how can you uh, vote? Oh, they're about to throw oh, them in. Chief Nick. Scoring the goal good. early. And as predicted, if they can keep this up, <laughs> I think they might do good. And I love to see that. That's got to be a great confidence boost for the Wada Esports. But for chasing no problem it's just an early goal it's only game one they can always feel it out and understand what's going on from here Trey. absolutely i'm trying to get you some game sound real quick so urban keep going baby urban's gonna keep going watermelon looking for a nice open net and it's gonna be open i mean two two noodles was there oh but he was my goodness this behind. is a new wada esports boys i am so yeah. hyped let's go <laughs> Yes, it was open with power, and that's what Wada did. Two, do two noodles, two doodles. Oh, it's doodles. Two, two noodles. noodles. <laughs> a little too far from the post, and that ball just got a little away from him. But good attempt to save it, but Wada Esports coming in with the goals, dude, from out of nowhere. Like, where did this come from? I, I love to see it. But uh, we'll have to see how Cheezen can respond if they can take control of this game, or else it might fall apart. Ha might fall apart. Quickly, if I'm trying to enunciate my words properly. What a 50 by Mushroom Man. He's trying to show him who's the boss. Chief Nick fakes it for Maester. But Watermelon's like, I don't want Maester to hit it this way. I want to hit it the other way. And Chief Nick's like, alrighty then. Gets absolute demos through one man. Alrighty Gets then. <laughs> no, not a deep pass. But, uh, wait, wait, wait. I'm trying to remember these names. You're going to have to let me get used to this. That's a kind of a... Two oh, I noodle thought. strikes back, though, for good old only cheesing. Putting their first goal in for the day. Honestly, just solid rotation there. Caught one of them out lacking. And that'll be the first goal for only cheesing in the day. I like it. I want to see Maniac. more. Keep this series close. I was going to say, I saw Maniac try to steal that goal there. I respect it. Dude. <laughs> to Teammate, I want to see more of that, too. Make it more funny. Chief Nick with the absolute Chief double. Nick? What? Oh, it was Ooh. close. 
Oh, it's a great it's pass. Going. Oh, Maniac, what a save on the goal line. Now he does have possession on the side wall. Good. 50 with Melon on the side and gets one touch. Now he fakes it out. Leaves it for Chief Nick in the middle. It will be a pass down to a teammate. Watermelon up for the shot. Doesn't get contact. Now it will be left for Blue to take over on this one. Meister has a good pass out mid to a teammate. Watermelon wants it. He has the touch off the wall. It's a perfect slot into the middle of the net. Watermelon from what are Esports. Let's Ooh. go. Let's go. Oh. What a melon! As Trey put it, beautiful shot, top bin, didn't hit the post. We don't need that crossbar counter today, because we're going to keep it nice and low for Wada Esports. But man, it's just crazy how they're doing. Solid, weird kickoff here, but we're going to figure it out. Maniac, going to take it up the wall. That's a little dangerous, but I like to follow up. Keeping possession of the ball here. He's going to go back for boost. Watermelon's like, well, too bad. So sad. I'm going to pass it to my teammate. Nice Oh! Close, but Chief Nick's like, I got you, baby. For now, but two doodles is like too bad as well. Takes it up the wall, gets a feet over water. That might just be in the net. Oh it is. man, these guys are hitting upper 90s more than my teammates in competitive at Grand Champ, guys. What are you doing? You're so cracked. Oh, that's my. another upper 90, though. I can't believe it. <laughs> just skims past the bar, like perfect shot placement. And I gotta these say, water watermelon, I love that skin. I wish I had that decal, I don't. Mm -hmm. Uh, but if you knew how to forge it on Xbox, I'd love it. But besides that, uh, Cheezin <laughs> is coming back here. They're showing even though we got scored on early, we're not down and out of this yet. And we're going to keep it up here as Maniac takes it up the wall. But Meister's probably going to beat him first. Meister says, I don't want to touch it. Watermelon's like, well, I don't want to touch it either. But Maniac's like, well, let me try and score. Doesn't get the shot on goal, but that's okay. He's just playing with his food right now. But Two Doodles is like, well, I don't want to play anymore. We're not playing with our food. We're going to try and score. Maniac's taking it up the corner. Can anything happen in this corner? We're flipping around. No boost. Gets his boost. Yoink. And someone. Oh, there we go. Mushroom Man's touching it up the wall. Now he's thinking about it. Still thinking about it. Everybody's thinking about it. But Chief's like, I don't want to think anymore. And we're just going to play ball. Hit e ball. Hit ball. And that's what I like to see. Kind of some pinch action in the middle. Is something going to come of this? Watermelon fakes it. Huge fake. Doodles is a Doodles just said, I can't even talk. Doodles wasn't surprised by the fake and then just gets yeeted off the field and then Maniac's going for a shot watermelon says ah dang it I didn't miss that but that's okay mushroom man's thinking about it. doodles is like I'm gonna pass it mid to myself oh my gosh oh, no way <laughs> Oh that's no, it's so... a breakaway opportunity for Maester. He has it on this wall. Lots of boost. It's a shot near target. It's going to be floating. Nick Champs, he gets the shot. The goal for Wada Esports. A minute 40 left on the clock. Maester with the perfect setup. And the Chief Nick throwing it down for the Wada Esports squad. Man, they're just making it look easy. They got that team chemistry going. And they're putting quality shots on net. And I was going to say, I checked the stat sheet. And Maester has yet to score. Uh, a goal in the league so I'm hoping he gets his first goal of the league this series as well but so far he's just doing a great job of being the supporting player uh, yeah. Teammate. yeah maybe he's just the playmaker you know he just sets up his team to success nothing wrong with that at all as watermelon's gonna take 50 here with mushroom mushrooms thicker than I'm gonna put ex 10 extra pounds in his octane wish I had Sheesh. that cheat code but I don't sometimes Mushroom man tries Chief to get a bit with that oh, amazing yeah. flick though. Oh my goodness, Aqua does control this into his corner. Finally, does have a 50 with Maester here. Looks like we'll go in favor of neither of them. Maester and two doodles here on this wall. Chief Nick has a little bit of possession, tosses it on over to the sidewall. Does pick up some boost in the meantime. Now be Maester in the corner with Aqua. Aqua goes. Demos coming out of Orange Team. This could be a great opportunity. Watermelon just has to put it on net. He gets a weak shot and two doodles gets it. The save and Chief Nick does take it in the midfield now mushroom man alone with defense leaves it for aqua chief nick now opportunity it's on target good diving save from two noodles and now it's a double commit from two orange players nothing comes of it only 30 seconds left in this match mushroom man will have this on the sidewall anything else can come from this one just kind of leaves it for orange team now watermelon likely to follow two doodles cuts it off now it will be maester again on the sidewall boost to work with doesn't get the touch though mushroom man will also make that with no boost to work with chief wanted a shot but it's not gonna fall 15 seconds oh my goodness i'm gonna say without a doubt Water Esports has this one. I'm not going to say there's a chance. Oh, Caster Curse. <laughs> they have Caster Curse. Urban, don't say that. Urban, don't say that. Oh, you got to be kidding me. Urban, there's still three seconds. 
Maybe I spoke to so. Oh my god. I, <laughs> no chance they come I'm back. I'm sorry in advance for Wada Esports. You don't deserve Urban. Like, <laughs> no chance. Okay. Two, you know one, happened? and it dies. It dies, Urban. You're off the hook this time. No, Wada, I remember. Lucky, lucky dog. Lucky, Game three lucky and dog. And they got an unfortunate kickoff goal, and then they lost an OT. Wada wasn't going to let that unfortunate kickoff goal happen again this game. And they steal the dub here. But yes, I got lucky there. I almost was pretty nervous. But you almost will have fallen on Kate's though, you know, with the good old cast of curse. So, okay, if you're Wada Esports, you finally took your first dub of the series. Do you keep riding this high? Or will this be a turning point and will only Cheese and start to make their comeback in the series? Um... I think Chiza needs to work a little better as a team. Looks like Two Doodles was kind of the hard carry that game with all the goals and and shots. But and I think I like how Wada played just because they were passing to each other. Like Maester setting up two of the goals for his team, and then Watermelon and Chief Nick scoring, getting plenty of shots. Um, so I feel like if Chiza's uh, if Maniac and Mushroom get a little more into the game, they'll do better. Um, but yeah, I feel like Chiza just needs to. Play a little bit better as a team in order to have more success. And I think Wada <laughs> Esports ain't broke, don't fix it. So just keep playing. But yeah. Do you see <laughs> Whirl in chat? He actually just wanted to time out Tyler. So if we have a mod in chat, please get on that. And uh, Tyler will be saying goodbye for at least five minutes. And he will be timed out. And Whirl being <laughs> the harbor of chaos. Let's get back into this game. Wada Esports is hyped. Only Cheeson needs to make a comeback. And I think they can do it. I think they absolutely can do it. Oh, but definitely. But this is game two. This is game two. This is Wada Esports. And now, it is time for Maester to score his first ever Golden League. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Oh. Woo! Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. Or watermelon squeezy, I should say. As Maester <laughs> pounds it dead center with the neural agitator goal explosion. One of my favorites. And I respect that a lot. And I'm glad we got to see it. Maester, that a boy. And uh, another quick start. Quick kickoff goal, basically first game, and now kickoff goal second game. Let's see. But Cheeson was able to bounce back late in the game, so we'll have to see how they adapt to this again, But unless they are don't fall into the same trap as game one. But so far, Doodles pounds it along the wall. Melon gets it. I don't know, K-50, okay, nothing wrong with it. What a and demo <laughs> on the back line. That was incredible. Oh. Now it is Aqua here. Good old clear in the corner. Doesn't quite get out before Watermelon takes a shot off the post. It doesn't go in. The crossbar is a great defender. And now it'll be Orange still on attack. Mushroom Hen has a good a good little clear on this corner. Chief Nick wants a shot. Doesn't get it around the last one. And now it'll be Maester on this wall. Can he get it up high to a teammate? Does have two doodles. Actually getting a great shot on net. Not his teammate, but the opposite team. Takes a shot. And uh, that's already the first minute. Why do sports early lead? I love to see it. Yeah, good for them. And Cheezen shouldn't be too worried. They had plenty of game left. They got plenty of time, as that might be an own goal. No, no, we're okay. That would have been rough. That would have been an urban living moment right there if he owned goal there. But that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> I love but, urban uh, living moments. Yeah, I live for them. Love them as well. You know, they're, they're the prime time of everybody's life. But Aquamaniac going for a nice wall aerial. Gets it to pass out to his team. Mushroom Man's there. Mushroom Man? Oh Just my goodness. Back. Chief Nick, though, with some solid control off the wall there, but unfortunately brings right down the doodles. But Watermelon's like, I got you back, bro. Taking it along the wall. Gets it. it might be another one here. Steals the boost, but Mushroom Man taking control of the pass. Gets beats, beats one. Maester's right there, though. I like the pressure from Wada Esports. They're putting on the pressure. Doodles, though, able to control it a little bit. Awkward bangs it out, but Melon there with a shot, maybe? Calculated pass to himself, 100%. Now he's going to shoot it. He fakes the shot to his teammate. Oh, <laughs> this is demos. Chief Nick's thinking about it. Now, this might be a difficult one. You know, I would miss that too. Don't feel bad about that. But Watermelon looking for a 50 right off the Chief Nick here. With as we got two and two minutes and 50 seconds to go, Trent. Definitely a much lower scoring game so far. Only goals so far coming out of Wada Esports. But that double tap. Oh my gosh, two doodles. You're insane. Chief Nick doesn't get the 50 that he wanted. Now, Aquamaniac will take over. Maester has this one to the corner. Nothing else comes of it. Blue surmounting its pressure. Will, be, will a goal become of it? Maybe not. 
but maybe it will, as we do have a good old clear for himself. Pass over to Watermelon and Mace Terry doing some awkward bump plays, but they do get a touch on it. Watermelon, slight control, doesn't get around the first offender. Now it'll be Chief Nick taking lots of big clears and uh, kind of straight into a blue team. Now it will be Aquamaniac with a shot of his own. No defender back, but Watermelon diving gets there with two minutes left on this clock. Body Esports is looking a lot better than they did in game one. But they've only scored one goal, so anything can happen. I'd love to see Blue either tie this one up or at least just... The pressure right now is incredible. I'm I'm surprised they haven't scored yet. Yeah, just solid defense by these guys. Solid rotations, and their only goal was the kickoff. So, like, you know, overall, both these teams seem to have adjusted to each other. That's why it's, in my opinion, a neutral game so far. Just the kickoff goal is the reason why Watt is ahead, but... Uh, Cheezen is trying to make, as he beats two, they're trying to make a push here. He, Mushroom Man probably should try and play for the boost or a 50, that works. Chief Nick, double commit in the corner. You know what? Double to commit, double to power. That's what I'm telling you. That's all that needs That's to happen. That's what I've always said. Maniac here. The maniac has a oh, shot. Yeah. Chief Nick has to go. What a save, bro. What a by Wada, dude. Oh, man. That would have been one heck of a play for Chief Nick, but Wada says, not today, our chief Nick no, Tech. No, no, no. Wada Nick, did you call him? <laughs> yeah, Wada Nick. Yeah. <laughs> it's all right. I'm going to probably mix it in. Good control, good catch by oh, Melon. Oh, my goodness. Just, oh. This could be a great flick. Oh, he went a little bit early. He left Aquamaniac in a good position to save that one. Off the oh. backboard. Can any of his teammates read it? Maester wants the goal. The bump like doesn't quite work out. Oh, my gosh. Watermelon Maester trying to do some eight ball shenanigans. That will be Chief Nick on this wall. Can you get it around, Mushroom Man? No, you cannot. And it will be two Orange Defenders beat. One left. And now Aquamaniac gets a great shot. Not going to do anything else. Watermelon on this wall. Can he get Chief Nick? Chief Nick clears it to himself. What the touch? Oh, my goodness. That would have been a crazy double. Only 30 seconds left. Urban, how will Cheezen come back in this game? Um, They're going to have to believe to achieve right now because they got 18 seconds. They did it last time. They shut me up last time. They almost pulled it off. Can they do it? They did it in about right now. So let's see if they do it right now. That might be their opportunity. It's been... Oh. Good 50 by the defense there. They still have a chance, though. They're taking turns. Mushroom's like, ah, never mind. Now they're bumping each other. They can't decide what to do. Maniac keeps it up. Two Doodles keeps it up. Well, Maniac and Mush somebody respond. Oh, Doodles. They trust him with the dribble. He pops it over. What gets me to the shot? Oh! <laughs> you got to be molding after that. That is insane. Oh, it's on the goal line. <laughs> Psionic just told Jesus, not today. Not happening. That's tough. Do oh, we see man. Wada Esports sweep here? They are in perfect position to sweep after going 0-2 in this season right now. That would be quite a crazy comeback for Chief Nick and his friends. Wow. Yeah, but uh, I don't want to uh, jinx them. As, oh, uh, now you don't want to jinx anyone, Irvin. Ha, ha, ha. I say games 3, 4, and 5 matter the most. So now Cheezen's just been hustling Wada the whole time. And they're going to show why games 3, 4, and 5 are the most important. Because if you win 3, 4, and 5, you win the series, strike. So therefore, Cheezen still has a chance. <laughs> they just were throwing for the content. Charity goals to Wada. You think you're a reverse sweep? Oh? <laughs> I really <laughs> hope. That would be my content. Vice back, <laughs> my vice is about to hope so. But I also did bet on Cheezen to give Wada their first win because whoever I bet on is cursed. Um, that is how that works. Well, sorry in advance to Cheezen, but I do believe in them. And since I always believe in the team that's losing, I am now a huge Cheezen fan. So Cheezen, keep it up. You just have one unlucky kickoff goal. So I'm going to say if they don't get a kickoff goal here on this game three, Trey, I think they're going to do good. But let's see if I eat my words in these next uh, six to ten seconds. Unless they get one of their own. No they way, Mushroom Man. No! He can't put it in. Mushroom Man could have had the perfect opportunity. Doesn't quite make contact. Two Doodles has a good opportunity. Cheezen wants to go. Ooh, would have been crazy. Double angle. If he gets contact there, Aquamania in this corner. Can he do anything? Watermelon straight onto the midfield for Mushroom Man to clear this one. Maester now pops it up high. Chief Nick's up early for the area. He had two jumping for it. Now it is a great opportunity for Wada Esports to put this one in. I would love to see Wada Esports put this one in, and then they put it in. Wada Melon of Wada Esports scores first in game three. Yes, and I got to say, I can't, as much as I want to cheer for the other team, Wada just has my heart, dude. He's rocking the halo. And that's like, I rock that halo no matter what. It's oh, the most yeah. important popper in the game. Like, 
And that's why he scored for sure. It's because he's wearing a topper. Um, for all those people who tell you toppers are bad, I disagree. But you oh know. Oh my gosh, dude, doodles. No, it's off the crossbar and out. Dude, the crossbar has been two doodles bane of existence today. <laughs> they smoked it a few times. I think Wada has too, but it's just seemed to be more apparent for uh, Cheese in here. But I believe four minutes left, you got to believe to achieve. As they're struggling a little bit in the corner here, but uh, they're going to triple trip. commit. It's, oh, it's a oh, free no. goal for Chief if he puts it on net, and he yeah. will. Very good goal. Wada Esports will take that, as they do need a win in this DCRL season so far. But you hate to see a triple commit come out. You only cheese in. But Wada Esports, that's what I'm talking about, baby. You know, they went for the triple commit, triple power pinch. <laughs> Irish, that would have been the most freestyling pinch I've ever seen. They didn't get it. And uh, unfortunately, they're going to get scored on again here, Drake. Oh, no. Uh, they Wada. sure are, yeah. <laughs> on your way with this game, Watermelon. Kickoff goal, another kickoff goal. He just reads that. Gets a perfect touch. And no one to be found for Cheeson. Cheeson's going to have to pull something out of their booty if they're going to win this game. It's only been a minute, Urban. <laughs> I know. This is rough. Last game, there was literally only one goal. And that was good old Wada Esports. And now there's been three goals. And it's all Wada Esports. All I'm saying, Wada Esports might be back and they might be with a vengeance coming to the rest of these weeks of DCRL Division C. Chief Nick wants another one, hits the high. Now he does have a teammate gonna follow this one up into the corner. Good pass out mid if he can get one. Walk, walk. Not quite two doodles. We'll take control of this one finally for Wada Esports actually just takes this one in the corner. Good 50 from Aqua. Now it'll be into the corner of Orange Team. Can he get a pass out mid? Actually, Maester helps him out with that one. Could be an easy shot, but no. A great diving save off the back wall. Gets that one done. And Maester throws this one straight into the corner of only Sheezen. Oh my goodness, Wada Esports. You can't keep doing it to them. Stop kicking a dog while they're down. A lot of melon shooting accuracy has to be high. This man would snipe them every time. And they're hard, powerful shots, too. They're not Sally shots that go two miles an hour like mine, you know. They actually have power. They actually don't look jank and boring. Like, Jesus, I, this is just impressive to me. Uh, a lot of esports really showing up here today. And, you know, I don't want to curse them, but maybe I curse for the content. I don't think a lot of esports will lose this game three. I, I won't. <laughs> I, don't I think actually would, you. Game three. I uh, believe that, that way uh, won't lose. <laughs> they're playing too good right now. However, Cheezen, I hope you prove me wrong here. I believe in you guys just as much. And as right here, oh. they have an opportunity. Beats Watermelon. Oh, close. But you can still quickly turn. Maybe get a pinch mid or something. A pass of some sort. Doodles are thinking about it. Tries. Fakes it. I respect the fake. Maniacs looking for it. Wait. We might have some. Oh, oh my goodness. God. Almost over I'm goal. To <laughs> that is all. That was so hard to follow. Okay. Doodles. Loader in mid. Anybody there to shoot? Okay, if I'm cheesing, like, even if you're not the best at aerials, I think you should jump for that, even if you're going to miss. Because, like, you're down by four, at least try to shoot it. Um, just just in the situation you that you're gotta in. you got to push a lot more you know. offense than you're used to. That's what you got to do if you're only cheesing right now. you got to force everything, try to cut them off, boost, starve them, demo them, whatever you can to get any offensive going. Because right now you're being shut down. And you can't allow that right now. I mean, this is your last chance, your last lifeline. You got to win or go home. And right now, it looks like they're packing their bags. Yeah, it's tough. I mean, uh, Wada's just playing pretty consistent, man. And when consistency wins games, that's just an unfortunate pinch for Mushroom, man. Watermelon, maybe the shot here. Another pinch off mid, but Maester might have an open shot. It's a bouncer. Oh, it's Mushroom. Uh-oh. Mushroom. Got the way there. Doodles is up for it, though. Good speed by Doodles there. But now uh, Wada and Chief Nick wanted to give each other a little kiss. But Chief Nick's like, I'm going to give a bigger <laughs> one so I can fall first. And he passed a great pass mid. Anybody there for it? Wada is, but Doodles is there to cover it. And we're coming down to a minute left. This would be a Minneapolis miracle of sorts if Chief <laughs> can come back and win. I really wish they could. But if I'm being honest, I don't think it will. But that's a great pass. So probably Maester, he's going to take the shot. The floater. That, is that just a bounce again? Oh, no. They got some defense. Uh, cheese and don't let Chief, that type of go in. Chief oh. Nick has played so confident in this game. Uh, <laughs> sorry, hey, Chief that Nick. Was, That's on that me. Was, that was a confident aerial. It was confident, though, but he's played so confident. It's worked out really well for them so far. You just you just got to hit the ball there, maybe, my man. <laughs> That's fine. 
He did his job. Good confidence. Okay. I like it. He didn't do his job. He missed the ball, Urban. He went for the ball. That's doing your job. You sometimes Whoa. just don't do your job right. Well, we're giving participation trophies out now. A for effort. Oh, my I goodness, am. Urban. A for all the time. Great shot by Doodles, nonetheless, though, because Chief Nick was a little pushed. He was a little too off his, off his line, and that's why that aerial was a little tip. Uh, that's why he missed the aerial, in my opinion. He was a little too far forward. And a great shot by Doodles, nonetheless. But I don't think it's going to be enough as 20 seconds are left here. And as the time slowly dwindles down, can they get one for the road, maybe? Doodles says, nah. <laughs> Anybody say it's something for the road? Chief's like, I want one for the road. Gets to the corner. Goes for a cheeky pass. Mid Mellon? Oh, my. Oh, it was almost a snipe. Mushroom Man and Maniac. GG's Wada Esports have G -G. done it. They have broken the curse of being only defeated. Now they are 1 and 2 in this league so far. Very well played from Wada Esports. The only the only team in the league that has esports in their name. I love it. So I'm going to see if I can get these cams set up real quick. Urban, uh, how about you just chat? Yeah. Uh, to Blasky and Tyler, you're welcome that I bet on Cheezen to unfortunately make them lose. Because my curse, that's how it works. So, uh, you're welcome to all the people that bet on, uh, Wada. For anybody that bet on Cheezen, I am... You know, I'm not even sorry. If my curse could get Brit broken, I would, but, uh, it just doesn't work. <laughs> I don't know what to do. But, um, you know, it is what it is. And, uh, hopefully they can figure it out as time allows here. But, um... Yeah, solid game by Wada Esports there. They did a good job. And, um, Jeezen, they weren't playing bad, in my opinion. They just, uh, I feel like they just couldn't, um, follow up with the pressure of, of, uh, Wada there. They just, Wada just had a little too much consistency with the with their passes and not double double and triple committing even. I uh, felt that happened maybe a little too much on Jeezen's end. And, um... Yeah, that's just kind of how a lot I felt like won the game. They they all played good. It was fun to watch, and overall, um, Wada just came out on top there with a solid uh, 3-0 sweep. That's got to feel good for them as well. But absolutely, yeah. Keep going. Thank you. <laughs> keep, keep going. Um, Doodles, though. I really wish Doodles hit that double, man. That was like a clean double. That wasn't like just a simple bounce off the backboard, you take your time and you read it kind of thing. Like, that was like an aerial, like legit double that he went for and it's close. So I respect Doodles for going for that. Um, I respect Cheezen for going for the triple power team pinch. It's not a triple commit, it's a team pinch. That's what they were going for. That was nothing wrong with that. But, um... Let's see what else do we got here. Well, now with uh, Cheezen going one and two and Water going one and two, they have the same record. And uh, at least they got a win under the belt because some teams in the past have gone basically defeated all season. So it feels good to get that basically first Basically defeated. Okay. Pretty much defeated, you know. But uh, I think. Oh, you're not quite ready. I need to keep. One more, Urban. One more. Yeah, I don't know what else to say. Um, I hope everybody enjoyed. Urban's casting tonight. I hope they enjoyed our lovely Sir Trey's casting. Um, I don't know how y'all are able to play games at 5 p.m. right away. I mean, these guys, it seems like they're all playing we're Rocket ready, League. Urban. We're job. ready. And thank God we're ready because I am getting tired of Dolph. <laughs> all right, Chief Nick, Maester Watermelon, how you guys feeling after your first win tonight, boys? I think it was very long awaited, and we're, we've been waiting for this for a couple weeks now. Absolutely. I mean, I've been seeing Chief Nick throw in his, uh, his username into like washed and extremely washed after every loss. So, <laughs> oh goodness. I love it. I love it. <laughs> One second. I think we're trying to get Urban in here. And we finally got Chief Nick. There we go. Everyone's here. It's scuffed, but it's fine. Uh, how you guys doing then? Pretty damn good. I mean, you obviously just took down only Cheezin, so, uh... I mean, what, what, what happens after that? What happens because of that? You are now 2-1 and one this season. Give me some insight into how you beat them. I, I think... Our main problem we focused on from last yeah, I was, was definitely washed in the first two weeks, but um, we're back now. 
Yeah, I think after <laughs> we fixed our double commit problem, we were good. That's that's fair. That's fair. Urban, are you here? I think after looking at the stats, that's what I saw. So, did it feel good to get the dub? You were also the assist king. You seem you're saucing up your teammates. Go. Is that always your strat? Yeah, it's always the assist. Yeah. Ah, I got gotcha, you. I got gotcha. you. Fair enough. Testing, testing. Yeah, Trey, they are very quiet. It's that's probably why I didn't think they could hear me. But I'm listening now. Yeah. But, uh, thank you. Um. Yeah. Thanks for letting me catch your game. It was fun. Um. I love your guys' decals, by the way. Um, who planned to make your te your decals kind of match? Who was whose idea was that? I think it just kind of happened. Yeah. I think it was more of a team effort. Like, yeah, we just kind of threw them on. Wow, that's an impressive team effort if you just throw it on like that. You know how hard it was to make Heat put on the stupid decals that I made him do last season? The team effort. Like, that was yeah, an effort and a half. But uh, I'm glad you guys are just goats at putting on, and I love it. Keep it up. Uh, congrats on the first dub. Uh, Trey, do you have anything else to say to them? I mean, I'm just excited I mean, I'm just for what you can do in DC. I think we're about to run it. I think this is the start of something big for Wada Esports. I think so. I think you faced some difficult opponents uh, week one and two, Thank and you, now Evan. it's just smooth sailing. <laughs> yeah, no. Nothing but up from here. Sports. New org. Pro RLCS. New org. Right yeah. right you got to get sponsors you gotta get for sponsors land when you, land when you make it. When you make it. I could, I could, I could work some magic and get some sponsors for land. That's what I like to hear. <laughs> Perfect, boys. Thank, Perfect you Thank you for doing this. I will you see you later. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right, Urban. Can you hear me, Urban? Yeah. Hello, Urban. It was kind of sorry, sorry, Chad. If it was double auto, that was. A little it weird. was. It's scuffed. Everything's bad. Trace PCU doesn't want to live apparently, but it's fine. It's done. They did it. Wada Esports pulls off a sweep on only Cheezin. Hopefully, everyone got their buys and bucks. And uh, wow, I think the stream went pretty well for uh, everything that went wrong. First time actually yeah. making it through. <laughs> yeah, it seemed fine to me. Um. Again, thanks for uh, calling me out in the casters to force me to I've been busy, but I suppose I could set aside this half hour here. It was fun. Um, and man, yeah, um, it's fun seeing the all the teams uh, slowly improve because they want to definitely played a heck of a lot better this series than their first series. Could be against, depends on the team they were playing, but I think they just overall played better um, too. It's cool to see everybody improve and everybody posting in the clips. I mean, I'm yeah. eventually going to be a washed player compared to everybody else because I don't really play that much anymore. But uh, I don't know. I just love seeing everybody improve and uh, everybody play. And it's just fun. So, and it's fun to cast. And I hope people enjoy me casting. And uh, yeah, it was fun. Thanks for letting me do it. Absolutely. That will be it for the stream today. We had some Div C games later today. But I did have something come up where I'm a little bit busy. So maybe... Maybe someone can stream them from their point of view and you can check them out. Otherwise, we'll be done for today. Thank you all for coming on out and we will see you all later. Thank you for tuning in. Peace.